The Tony Hawk Foundation is teaming up with local groups to build skate parks right here in Michigan, and they're looking for the locations right now. That's right, and 7 Action News reporter Matthew Smith is live in Ann Arbor. Matt, how many skate parks are we talking about here? Oh, we're talking about the potential of 20 new skate parks. And the great thing about these, these are going to be free and open to the public. Now, we're here in Ann Arbor where they've got a great skate park that is already here. We're with Trevor, one of the guys that actually helped get it here. Uh, tell me just a little bit. We've got the skaters around us today. Uh, it wasn't even hard to get them out here right here for 645. It kind of tells you something about the culture here. Yeah, it's a little cool out here. And, uh, you know, it's early, but there's always a core group of people out here, even in the middle of winter, shoveling or whatever to get skating. So it's 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 really the most used park in uh, Ann Arbor right now. now. Tony Hawk Foundation, you guys are teaming up. We just said 20 parks. I mean, just the idea of doing this, this is a big undertaking. Yeah, so we're really uh, appreciative of the Ralph C. Wilson Jr. Foundation who stepped up, um, seeing that there's a need for kids to have free play and also uh, facilities to do that. And so the partnership with the Tony Hawk Foundation uh, is offering up to $250,000 grants to build skate parks in Southeast Michigan and Western New York. I know we're putting the call out there right now for people to reach out because you guys are looking for locations. Right, right. So uh, we, what we want to do, the focus is to have people come to us, see what's needed and wanted in the community, and then help facilitate that, what's best for each community in the area. All right, and right now we're taking a look and we, we see them in the bowl. Uh, just yeah. when you see this, uh, what does this do for you? So yeah, so we started this project in 2007 and it was a pretty big push. Um, it took about seven years to build this. Um, it was a dream of a lot of people in the community. Um, one of the reasons it took so long was uh, because of the funding, and that's why these grants are such a great opportunity is because with that funding piece sort of taken care of, a big chunk of it, it's going to be easier to get facilities like this built throughout the region. And even faster this time around. Trevor, we yeah. appreciate you taking the time right, this morning, and we appreciate all the skaters out there too. A lot of them getting better because of all the work that you guys put in oh, for this God. park. Hey, uh, 20 more parks going to be built in and around Southeast Michigan and Western New York. You want more information about how your group could potentially become one of those spots in that quarter of a million dollar grant? Check out WXYZ.com. We're live in Ann Arbor. Matthew Smith, 7 Action News. Yeah, love what they're doing there, Matthew. And I noticed, uh, yeah, you, you didn't take our hint earlier a couple hours ago, and we're like, hey, we don't yeah. see you on a skateboard. He's been a TV long no, enough. They, they've been pushing enough. me for it, too. Notice uh, I'm still holding out. <laughs> You're still holding out. <laughs> you know, there's always the two hours that we're on, on TV 20 Detroit. We're going to get you on there, Matt. We're not giving up. <laughs> no more than two wheels. I think a live television is. <laughs> yeah, it is dangerous, right? <laughs> yeah.